Lakeland College is a hands-on learning institution where we're able to bring the latest concepts and technologies to our students. And this year we're really pleased to introduce Top Grade Ag to showcase a grain storage and management system that will provide a learning lab for our students in grain drying and optimization. The farmer should be able to begin harvesting earlier to protect their grain quality and take advantage of the higher ambient air temperatures that would reduce the energy requirements for their grain drying. In order for farmers to embrace uh, the, the uh, idea of uh, proactive grain drying, there's two key components that need to be addressed. Uh, the number one thing is you absolutely need low cost on farm grain drying. The second item is how early can you take your grain? So to date, there's really no clear guidelines that would indicate to us when we could actually start drying down grain that wouldn't affect its quality. What we're attempting to do in our partnership with Top Grade Ag this year is to harvest small plots at various moistures and dry them down to then take that grain and have it sampled and tested for various quality parameters. Up until now, it is, it is believed that, that crops need to be cured in the field. And this is a, a critical piece of the puzzle that, that needs to be understood. Grain dryers are typically a, uh, a luxury item. By introducing instrumentation on, on common aeration bins and providing a dashboard to convert that bin to a built-for-purpose grain dryer, it introduces an option for all farmers to have low-cost on-farm drying. We've set up a, a research where, uh, where we're basically planting canola, wheat and barley, and we were taking some very early, we're drying it down to see if it is feasible to cure these crops in bin. Utilizing a, uh, a single ambient air sensor and then, uh, and then independent sensors for each drying bin, the IBD monitor uh, sends this data to the cloud and our, uh, our uh, algorithm calculates real-time water removal rates from each drying bin. This gives the farmer a, a dashboard and it allows them to analyze and optimize their, their in-bin drying events. And it also is a really good laboratory for students to learn and understand what impacts the drying rates, the ambient humidity, how the ambient temperature impacts the rate of grain drying, how much airflow is currently flowing, how much airflow do we need, is supplemental heat necessary or is it not necessary? And if it is, how much supplemental heat do we need to add and how to help optimize these systems in the future. The Lakeland College Applied Research works with researchers from across Canada on various projects as well as with industry to help test and provide a third party independent evaluation. We want to be able to bring industry together with our, with our students here at Lakeland College, the student managed farm powered by New Holland and Meridian along with Top Grade Ag, we're able to test, showcase, and demonstrate to students a lot of the, the newest technologies and concepts that are available so that they can take that back home to their farms.